Hello, chess lovers. Here in front of me I have a very special and very old chess set. It was made about a hundred years ago in Celje, Yugoslavia. It is a very big chess set. Look at this rook fitting in the palm of my hand. And it is a very special one because it was not used for playing but for demonstration purposes on a big chessboard hanged on the wall. They don't make them like this today. Today we are using plastic flat chess pieces with magnets, but these are made in 3D. Look at the bishop and the knight. A very beautiful knight, I have to say. Nicely carved. And here I have a few damaged pieces. This is a uh, king. Unfortunately, both kings are missing the cross and both queens have damaged crowns. If I get them restored by Alan Dewey of USA, this will probably cost me a fortune and I will have to think about it. This knight is missing a snout. I only saw these kind of pieces once in a YouTube video when uh, Mikhail Tal was doing some kind of demonstration of one of his games on a big Russian chess demonstration board and the pieces were similar but not exactly like this. This set was made as I said in Celje and every piece has the maker's stamp on it. Let me read it for you. It says Dominic Loshin Strugar Celje meaning Dominic Lovshin Carver from Celje and all of the pieces have the same stamp on them. This is a very beautiful find. I'm especially intrigued by this special mechanism. They didn't use magnets back then, but the chessboard that I don't have, unfortunately, but will try to find it, was hanged on the wall and probably had some hooks on every field. So, this is a fascinating chess set, a nice piece of chess history.